Liu Bei's army, aided by the resourcefulness of warlord Zhu Ge Liang, repels the forces led by Cao Ren. However, now that he is secure in his conquest of the northern provinces, it is all too clear that it will be only a matter of time before Cao Cao turns his greedy eyes to the south. A cloud of dread spreads slowly toward the Jing province. We need to decide what our options are. Yes. What ideas have you come up with? Cao Cao's army is vastly superior to ours, but his generals think little of our strength. That's their greatest weakness. Let's take them by surprise and attack their headquarters first. Then we can go in and steal their food and provisions. This must be an example of how the world has turned into a pit of depravity. A man-eating tiger lurks in the area, so let it confront the Black Dragon. What we need is training, if you ask me. We'll beat them at their own game. That's how we'll become victorious. Let's take action. I'm open for any suggestions that you may have. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, back to KSN 2. It's the Battle of Changban time. Now, we could kill the man-eating tiger. Which will, what it basically does is buffs Guan Yu's stats, makes him better. We could train troops, but it's kind of like buffs like a couple, two officers stats, makes them a little bit better. Or we could intercept enemy supplies, lower the morale and stuff. We're going to intercept the supplies. Or are we? Do we really want to do that? Or do I want to buff Guan Yu? We're going to intercept the supplies. I agree. Let's do it! Yes, yes sir! The surprise attack was very successful. We took all of the provisions and then we left. So that is really good. We've increased our own supplies by 4 and their morale is dropped by 5. That doesn't sound like a big deal, but in reality it will be. In practicality. In a concerted effort to conquer the world, Cao Cao begins his march out of Zhu Chang. Meanwhile, the Jing province has fallen into an abyss of misery and disorder as a direct result of the massive destruction they have suffered through. Overwhelmed by Cao Cao's army, Liu Bei is unable to press his attack. Instead, he heads for Jia Ko to recuperate and rebuild his ranks. Hearing the news of Cao Cao's imminent approach, Liu Bei's army collapses in defeat without so much as a fight. No matter how many battles we win, Cao Cao's army gets stronger! You'd think heaven was on his side! Ah, shut your mouth! How can heaven be on the side of a cold-blooded tyrant? He's heartless. He's out for his own gain. Now even our loyal friend Zhao Yun has gone and deserted us! I'm not surprised at that. He favored the restoration. All that you want is Jiao Chan. It's all you dream about. I'm walking on a different path than you. Bad news! Mason Yan and Zhuge Liang have gone and deserted us too! No, that can't be true! I heard they were seen heading toward enemy headquarters. Mason Yan? Oh no! <laughs> Serve me too while you have the chance. I know that Cao Cao will be overjoyed when he hears the news. <laughs> oh, brother! Don't you remember the oath we made? Hmm? That day in the Grove of Peach Blossoms. That was the day you took us as brothers. Born apart on separate days. But when we die, may it be the same day. And at the exact moment. We were once outlaws that were scorned by everyone. That changed. That day I decided I'd do anything for Brother Liu Bei. <laughs> Brother! Even if the whole world forsakes you, I will never leave your side, not even for a second! <laughs> <laughs> Please, your crying has to end. Now stop it! 
you'll make me start crying too. <laughs> My brother! <laughs> All right, begin the council. According to the information from our scouts, the enemy is located here. If we attack Kao Kao's army head on, we haven't got much of a chance. South of Chanban Po is Sun Quan's territory. One way or another, we need to get there. If you can make it here, then we will have a very good chance of winning the battle. But, if your unit is forced to flee, then we will all be defeated. I agree. Tell me what options there are. Listen to my strategy. We will fortify the route that the enemy is most likely to take. I will keep this bridge open for you, brother. That will be your escape. I have another way in which to serve you. I'll defend the shortest way through this valley. But I've heard reports that the enemy has a large cavalry, so time is of the essence. Liu Bei, if you run away, then stick with me, of course. Our minds and my ambush will totally stop the enemy. You must choose a strategy! Yeah, this one's pretty easy. The Western Bridge is not good because it leaves Zhang Fei exposed and the same with Guan Yu when you take a central route. We're gonna go Lili's. As you can see we have a lot of enemies. Yao Ba, Yao Duns, Zhang Liao, Sao Ren, Diang, we have lots. We don't want to even try and um, fight that. So we want to go and do Lili's. Uh, we're gonna escape through the forest. Lili will ambush. Whoever comes down this way and the mines will hit them too. Zhang Fei is going to cross the bridge and then he's going to hold the bridge and Guan is going to retreat down here and hold this area. And yeah, we're going to do well, that's basically our strategy. I've made my decision to battle. Yes, yes sir. sir. Alright, so let's do this. We are first and foremost going to change a few things. Zhang Fei, cross the bridge, please. Go on, you. Come down here. And everyone else can maintain what they're doing. But I need Go on, you and Zhang Fei to move from those positions they're in. Are you in a suitable formation? It's because this is going to be a defensive battle. This isn't going to be an offensive one, so we want to hold out for as long as we can. That's an attack formation. We don't want an attack. I think we're going to go Moon um, for you. We're going to go defensive. And for you... Yeah, that's already good. Really, this is all good. All good. I just need, I just need these guys to move, like very quickly move, because South South forces is literally right behind us. If we swap over to Liu Bay, and then just take a look behind us. Yep, I see one. I see two. I see three. I see four armies all chasing us right now. Go on, you. Are you going to get there anytime soon? Anyone to come in behind you? Not yet. Zhang Fei, are you going to cross this bridge? Right. 
Right. We've crossed the bridge, now turn. I want you to chokehold the enemy on this bridge, Zhang Fei. There you go. You chokehold them right there. I will not lose you. Don't even think it. I won't go easy on you, just because you're small. And I think this has worked. Have we got them on the bridge? We have them on the bridge. Lulu. Lul. Right, we can't do anything just yet. Let's have a quick look at Eugen's unit. Obviously it vastly outnumbers us, but does it outclass us? Eugen himself is a decent but not amazing guy. We have Dong Zhu of Feng, Zhuan Feng, she's quite tough. And Zhi Zhuan Feng, what do you have? You have a battle cry and a volley. You have an iron wall. And you have rush. So quite a number of quite a fair number of um Quite a fair number of tactics there, whereas we only have Zhang Fei and Liu Liu. So game over, Sal Sal's dead, game over, <laughs> I wish. Anyway, are they in range of the volley yet? Not quite. And that's our minds. Jihal Dun just lost a crap ton of troops and morale. Impertinent fool! And then Li Li should ambush him as well on top of that. Right, can we volley yet? Oh, the entire enemy army is in disarray from that. Hit them with a volley. I hope this does a lot of damage, because we need to take down Eugen quick. If we can, that is. We just need to basically just hold off and make time. Yeah, Not as much damage as we could have done. Zhang Fei, can you get in there? You can raid now, can't you? So as soon as you can get in there, get in there and raid. Do it. I'm the one in your nightmare. No fun. Come on, that should have done a lot of troop damage. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that. Holy hell, look at that. Now then, let's go! Impertinent fool! I was still trying to go over that raid. That did like 3,000 KOs. Right, so you guys are pretty much good. Now, I need to check on... Go on you. I need you to turn. Actually, is this where I want you to hold up? Right. One you's gonna hold possession there. Lily is not going to win this fight. She just doesn't have any special maneuvers whatsoever. 
which makes things difficult. Let's use Jewel. If you're mad enough to handle it, I'll give you the honor of a duel with me! What do you say? Forget it. You're simply not my type. Yeah, Eugen is awful in this game. Just awful. They've taken a really cool character in history and made them awful. Here. That lowers the morale a little bit. Charge up, guys. So it looks like that is the only real unit that's causing us trouble. They, they're going to need to send that unit in eventually, though. Right, that's going well, but... Guan Yu is about to engage their first enemy. Him by yourself, Zhuge Liang? The Lord Sorceress prevented me from bringing you his head. Now that you've seen it, do you believe I am loyal to you? Huh. You are incredible. Well, I must get back to my troops. Please excuse me. Goodbye. I'm awfully sorry, I forgot to hit unmute all this time. That's embarrassing. Anyway, so who's she? Quite a strong war. She's got duel, so we can duel her. She's with dark formation. Her morale is at 70. Ours is at 88. I think this is worth the chance. We're gonna duel! Got an 18 morale advantage. Is there no one who will fight against me here? I do need to win this though. I'll fight you. You can even make the first move. If I lose, Juliang is gonna have to come and back up one year. Ha! Yes, we win. I lose that! Weakling! 
now even Black Dragon is crying. That was so good for us. Zhang Fei, are you not finishing off Eugene yet? How's this battle going? Lulu, Lu, it's time for a volley. I did a lot of damage. Not enough, but... Right, Lily, how's your retreat going? Not good enough, you're straight into battle again. That's okay. Right, let me have a look at that. Um, yeah, just keep on retreating from battle. Just keep on retreating, just hold off. Go on, you, you should be winning this by now. You should be okay to win here. Damn, Guan Yu's been teamed up on. Yeah, I am gonna change Yugo Yang's. Don't wanna lose any units, so. As you wish. Now I must be gone. I wonder if I can handle what's coming with just two units. Mei Sanyang is back. Right, what's your formation? Making bow and crossbow attacks. Why are you in that? Because you do not have bow or crossbow. Right, so we are base crossing. Now, we are not gonna, it's not gonna be as easy as just simply. Um, just simply going to that spot. There's gonna be someone else there that we need to take down. And I'm hoping. That Mei San Yang and Liu Bei can take it to do it. Forward! Now, Liu Bei, it's time to cancel your objective. Because uh, I don't want you to go straight there. I want you to go and only attack once Mei San Yang is attacked. As soon as we're done here. We are exiting this fight, and Jackie is going to go down south. Eugene is almost done for. Right. Go. You've done enough in um, keeping that bridge. You've done enough. 
really keep on retreating. Yep, there's Himiko. Right, Julian, are you in, are you attacking Sal Rain right now? Yes, you are. Right. Let's get back. Now, Sal Rain has Iron Wall. Which means he will probably do this. No, he didn't do it for that one. Okay. Surprising. One of these special maneuvers that I'm going to use on him, he's going to basically neglect with his iron wall. Surprise, you didn't choose to do it there. Well, that did a lot of damage, and his Zhuliang's spell ability has increased. Even better. All right, let's try this again. We'll try a lightning, because I have a feeling he's going to stop this one. No, he still is not using Iron Wall. Oh, Sauron's forces are just being destroyed, right. Now, Firestorm, but I really don't think this... You can see the range on this is quite high. So we are going to have to fall quite back, and he's probably going to deflect this one. If he doesn't, then his AI is really acting weird. Okay, his AI is really acting weird. <laughs> He's basically just lost 70% of his forces for no reason. Oh yeah, Sauron's done for. Look at that. He had 10,000 troops at the beginning. <laughs> right. No time. You be finish off Himiko. I think it does help that we um really retreat again. That we stole their provisions. I think that has helped. Right, I need to finish off Himiko as quickly as possible. You do a meet your shower straight just straight like that. That was good. Not quite what we need to finish it off, but good enough. Right, go. Attack. Come on, you, you need to finish off Huji. But you have no more special abilities left. There's not much I can do for Guan Yu. Apart from maybe do a little bit of like charging. Right, Liu Bei is fighting Himiko, we need to finish this off quickly. Liu Bei now has Iron Wall as well as Rally. That's helpful. But no offensive ones, no offensive um, capabilities. You're just still on the move. There's no one behind you, is there? I doubt it. Nope. I'm really surprised that Sal Rain is still in this fight. He lost all his troops. 
in a very short period of time. Yeah, Lee Lee, just keep pulling back. Just play a cat and mouse game with them. Is that Hu Ji? Hu Ji is finally on red. Check that out. So it's a morale of 19 against the morale of 50. 60 against the morale of 39. Morale wise, you'll, I'll let you fight Ji Hao down for a bit. Because morale wise, you've got them, but. We really need to take down Himiko and get the finish this battle off. Sal Ren's in the red as well, so soon um, Julian will be free too. We're just waiting now. We're just playing a patient game. Lily, I changed my mind. Can you. Your morale is dropping quickly. Fall back. It dropped by 7 points in the time that it took me to check last now. So, bye bye, you're going out of there. Right, Zhang Fei, are you you're you're not done, are you? You're not done moving. Um finish off join the fight against Himiko. You got your meteor shower to get? Nope. I do want to make sure that no other army has crossed the bridge. I can't see anyone. Yeah, no one has crossed the bridge yet. We're still good. Sorry, it's about to go down. Goodbye. Right, is that who's you done as well? Oh, perfect. Right. Push the attack on to Dianwei. I'm actually going to have to control Zhugliang here. Guan Yu has learned a new formation. Um, Swan, but... And he's also learned charge! Yes! This is why I like defeating as many officers and armies as I can, because my officers learn new things. Alright, let's go. Engage. Engaging with Dian Wei. Perfect. Himiko is going down very quickly. Let's use Guan Yu's charge. Technically can't control him just yet because he's not technically in battle despite the fact he's literally there we go. I'm gonna go forward just a little bit. Perfect. Show me what you're made of. Show me. How much did that do? A crap ton, look at that! And his war abilities went up because of that as well. So his war has went even higher. Yeah, if we can get Dian Wei... 
If we can take Dian way down, in addition, I doubt it, but... Once Himiko is taken down, I think I'm gonna actually hold Liu Bei there and not have him retreat and just try and take out as many of the officers as I can before I start losing one. Oh yeah, look at this, Dian Wei is like done for already. Right, let's do my favour. You may come here. We're gonna try this, we're gonna try and win as much battles, battles as we can, basically. Where is the rest of the enemy army though? That is what I am concerned about. We've won! Take that! How's it feel? Man! Right, perfect. Now normally this would be the... Oh damn. Was he too close? Right, okay, now I do want to do this. So, will you be hold your position? Two seconds, guys. Okay, so now we're going to change things up. We're going to leave Liu Bei here. So that um, when we need to, we can just leave. But we're going to try and kill as many enemy officers as we can to level up our guys as much as we can. Yeah, so this is what we're going to do. Definitely, I'm a, I'm a fan of this. Let's try and take that as many as we can. 
The other way is four, she should be going down any second. Lily, how are you doing? Can you spot where the heck is is everybody basically here? Yeah, there's an army back there. There's Yahal doing there. Yeah, come here. There is an army in the woods, in the forest area. How much time do we have to finish this off? How much time do I have to play? Plenty of time, really. So we're just going to play and have fun now, which you usually do not get. Usually this battle is like... Uh, must escape as quick as can. But we've actually done not bad here, I think. There's no enemy forces down that path. I have no idea where the enemy as armies went. But we are going to engage Yahaldun. And we might as well keep all of our people together. So we'll have... They still have more troops than us. They just... I don't know where their armies are. Right, so... Eh, uh, no, not that. Oh yeah, what's the spawn? Yeah, bow attacks, that's not... You You don't have bow. Yeah, you have you attacks, you have them. And I'm actually just going to turn Lily around. Because I want to see and scout out that forest now. See how many people are in that forest. There they are! Jihalba! Gentlemen! We will avenge my father! They'll pay for this in blood! So what do we have to look at here? We have Jihalba. Quite a good officer, he will destroy Li Li, no questions asked. He has Battlecry Raid and Duel. He is in a build formation as well, so Li Li... Fall the frick back. Who's that? And then we've got Jun Yu there. Go on Yu. Go on engage. Engage. Mei San Yang is already engaging. Right, okay. This is, this, before I lose a single unit, we will be falling back. I'm not going to do this to the point where I lose units. I want everybody to get experience from this. I'll we'll say the vast majority of South South's army decided to take the forests. We're going to try and wipe out as many of them as we can. Here we go, we've also got, we've got Zun Yu and Jihao Ba. Right. I need to take down Jihal Doon quick so I can get people over the bridge. But I've got Julian still has nothing in terms of special abilities. Misania, you have your meteor shower, but you can't use it on a bridge. Which is unfortunate. Right, I'm just going to have Zhang Fei reinforce Mei San Yang for now. Hold on there, we'll be there soon. Thank you, I'll pay for it later. Right. 
exactly. Things are getting a bit dicey now. We're at the point where I need to maybe consider getting Liu Bei to that point. There's Zhang Liao. Oh yeah, the morale is sky high. If I can take down Zhi Haldun, I'll class this as a win. So, Zhang Liao, just you wait. It's Guan Yu! Everyone prepare yourselves! Yeah, Guan Yu is now being double teamed. So... Yeah, I want you to fall back. Just try and ease as much of this as I can. Because we are so close to taking down Jihaldun. It's messy, but we're getting there. This is a nice little challenge I've given myself to see how many of the enemy army I can take down before having to pull the UB out. Come on, Jihal, do go down, man. Lily, you are again in battle. So close. Great, finally. Wait, what does this change? You're crossing the bridge, fantastic, that's what you need. Right, Zhuliang is now engaging Zhi Ba. I want... Guan Yu... Oh no, Guan Yu can stay fighting Lili. I want you to back up Guan Yu. You're traversing the bridge, that's fine. Just move forward just a little bit. Let's see how much damage we can do with this fireball. Oh, look at that. Five. Oh damn! Oh double damn! And Julian's spell ability increased again. Very good. Um, right, how's going you doing in battle with Zhang Liao? Not good! And you still get nothing. Really need to get Mei Sanyang across here.
Did you cross? Good, you've crossed. Zhang Fei, get across there. Hold on there. We'll be. This is really interesting. This is probably the most interesting time, this interesting run of this battle I've ever had. Jia Haoba, Zhuge Yang, Mei Xianyang, and Liu Yi all engaging him. Uh, he's in a bit of trouble. I need to do as much damage to Xiaoba as quickly as I can though. <sighs> is it even worth doing the Meteor Strike? I don't think it is. Not with so few people actually here. Oh, that's Gwon, you're in trouble now. Yeah, fall back from battle. Retreat! Yeah, good. You're out there. You are out this fake one, you, so as far as I'm concerned. I need reinforcements right away! Jia Hao Ba! Don't give up and destroy yourself! I will repay this debt! I will repay this debt! Yeah, as far as I'm concerned, Guan Yu, you are out, so just leave. Really, you're done as well. As much as I want it, I don't think I'm going to get any more officers. Oh, go on you, what are you doing? It's simple, you retreat that way. Ah, and there's another enemy army there as well. Who has finally decided to show their face? Sao Sao himself. Yeah. Yeah, this time we leave. We've eluded the enemy. We should be safe now. But that was very interesting. I really enjoyed that. That was the best run of that stage I've ever had. Don't think we're done yet. I will get Yao Chan back. Not a single army lost on that stage. Brother, we're lucky you survived that. I know. Now we go to Ziako and plan our attack. Huh? What was that? With the victory we have claimed in this battle, our army has finally gained the upper hand. Lord Liu Bei, I am joined by my brother-in-law, Peng Tong, and by Huang Zhang, who is master of the Bow of Giant Strength. I'm Pang Tong, and I am the cleverest fighter this side of heaven. Please call me Huang Zhang. And do take pleasure in my service.
Rokal has the Mandate of Heaven! Be strong! There's no way he can have the Mandate of Heaven! I'll prove it to you! You mustn't continue to fight, Liu Bei! There are boats filling the Chengjun River! Cao Cao is putting everything he has into this battle! He's going to destroy you all! You just have to get out of here! Diao Chan! Are you on a boat too? Answer me, Diao Chan! Well, that was fun. That was fun. I'm not gonna lie. An hour video though. Hey, yeah. Uh, well, guys, I'll see you next time. Thanks for being here. It's a pleasure to have you. See you then.